going on guys let's look at this problem right here this question is asking a device used to measure the radius of curvature of the cornea of the eye is called a keratomeler this is used for information when titling contact lenses in effect an illuminated object is placed a known distance from the eye and the image reflected of the cornea is observed the instrument allows the operator to measure the size of the virtual image if the magnification is found to be 0.037x when the object's distance is set at 100 mm, what is the radius of the curvature? So here they are asking to find out the radius of the curvature that can be calculated using this formula r is equal to negative 2f. But in order to find this one out, we have to know the focal length, but we don't have the focal length provided. So we have to find out the focal length. To find out focal length, we need to have the object distance and the image distance, but here they only provided the object distance, that's 100 millimeter but we have to find out the image distance. We have the magnification and we know that magnification is equal to negative SI over SO. Here SI is the image distance, SO is the object distance and M is the magnification. Now from this one we can find the image distance because we have the magnification provided and also we have the object distance provided. So let's go ahead and rearrange this equation and find out what is the image distance is. So here image distance is going to be negative m times s naught and uh, negative m is the magnification that is 0 0.037 and the object distance is 100 millimeter and if you multiply this one by this that's going to give you 3.7 millimeter and that's going to be the image distance since we have the image distance and the object distance we can find out the focal length using the lens formula that is 1 over f equal 1 over SO plus 1 over SI and uh, 1 over SO is going to be the object distance that's 100 and the image distance is 3.7 millimeter 1 over and this should be negative because we have a negative sign in front so this should be negative negative 3.7 millimeter and uh, if you rearrange and calculate for F value you will get negative 3.8 millimeter so this is our f value now we can find out our radius of curvature value radius of curvature is going to be negative 2 times negative 3.8 and that's going to give us 7.6 millimeter and in centimeter that's going to be 0 0.76 centimeter and that's going to be the final answer for this question i hope this helps thanks for watching